our goal here at Nachusa is to protect uh, rare and endangered habitat and expand that across the landscape. A lot of folks come here because we have unbelievable uh, grassland habitat. We have rare birds, rare plants, rare insects. Nachusa Grasslands, this project is critical for the future of conservation in Illinois. Illinois is the prairie state, but we've lost 99.9% .9 of that. One of the successes of this project is that we continue to bring in more people, researchers, stewards, staff. Unfortunately, in the spring of 2020, we had a fire that destroyed our equipment building. Um, and since then, we've rebuilt uh, that building, uh, not only bigger, but uh, what we're calling better as well. We also have a, a brand new seed processing facility that's attached to the building. Annually, we're bringing in close to 6,000 pounds of seed that we collect by hand, containing upwards of 200 plus species. We also have a, a science wing on our, in the building that enables scientists to, to come and prepare and, and organize their data before they take it back to their university. And Chisa Ford is really, how do we set up success for the next 20 years? And so, you know, when I look back behind me, I see, I see prairie, I see, endangered species, but I also see, you know, bison. We like to uh, consider them an ecological keystone species. You know, the bison create habitat that other species within the prairie need to survive. So, so last year we, we began um, kind of a shift in how we manage our, our excess bison here at Nachusa. We um, relocated 30 um, excess animals um, to the Cheyenne River uh, tribe in South Dakota. Ten of those animals went to uh, the Forest County Potawatomi um, uh, community up in Wisconsin. And to see these animals on the landscape and to know like where they're going, they're leaving the Chusa and going to do bigger and better things to help a, a community, you know, help restore um, some traditional practices, some culture back uh, within their communities is, is really, uh, really, really important. The Chusa Grasslands is an amazing place and, and we, we couldn't do this work without the the dedicated uh, staff, our volunteers, our donors. Um, you know, some of the most amazing work that I've been, been part of has, you know, re returning the prairie back to the land. Um, it's been just thrilling. And now with this new bison project that we're working on, to be able to return these animals back to indigenous communities is something that I never thought I would get a chance to experience. Really working hand in hand with our, you know, our, our donor and our supporters, you know, those are the folks that you know, we're all in this together and we need each other to make this happen and so we couldn't be more proud to, you know, be here fulfilling this work.